if you have a car radio and you want to use it in your home stick around because in this video I will show you how you can make your radio work with this simple computer power supply stick around hi welcome back I hope everyone is doing okay. In this video, I will be showing you how you can install your car radio to this simple computer power supply. It could be any type of radio. In this case, I have an Android here, but you could use a Bluetooth, Android, any radio. This procedure will work. And for this procedure, of course, we will be using the radio, the computer power supply, my speaker that I have here for testing purposes, safety number one, I'm going to be using this uh, electrical tape, and this computer power cable. Let's start with the computer power supply. The computer power supply has a bunch of cables. We are gonna concentrate on this long cable here. This one's we're not gonna use this bunch of cables here. We're gonna use these long cables. We're gonna start cutting the green wire we're gonna cut this wire which in this case was this one here this was the green wire that was here I cut it and you're gonna come in here and cut one of these black wires that are here we have a bunch of black wires and you can cut any of them this case I cut this one which in this case was this one I already cut the wires and the green wire that you cut which was this one we're gonna connect it with the black wire you connect you uh, cut from here these wires we're not gonna use they'll be useless we're gonna concentrate on these wires here we're gonna hooked up the green wire with the black wire together. We're gonna put these two wires together. We're gonna tape them so they don't touch each other. Get a piece of tape and tape them. these same wires we're gonna cut the yellow wire which in this case was this one which I already cut I already stripped and everything the wire is cut now we're gonna turn over your radio your radio is gonna have a bunch of cables with different colors but we are going to cut from the back of the radio, we're gonna cut the green, I mean, sorry, the yellow wire and the red wire. Right here. We wanna connect these two wires together, the yellow and red. We're gonna connect them together. And the wire we cut from here, which was the yellow, and in this case right here, we're going to connect it together with the yellow and red wire on the back of your radio. 
these three wires are gonna go together. You're gonna tape them to wires this is a simple procedure and fast easy to do now we're gonna come again to these wires and we're gonna cut a black one we're gonna cut another black wire which in this case was this wire here that I already cut And you're gonna find on the back of your radio, you're gonna find the ground wire, which is gonna be black. So you're gonna cut net these two wires together, black and black, which is going to be brown. Black from your power supply and black from the back of your radio. They are going to be together. We're gonna tape them to We don't have any uh, wires touching each other or touching any metals. Now, on the back of your radio, we're gonna find these speaker wires, which are color coded as white and white, green and green, purple and purple, and gray and gray. This represents speaker wires. I have my speaker here, which I will be connecting to one of those speaker wires. In my case, I'm going to be using the gray wires. I'll be connecting these wires. them just like I did with the other ones if you have a radio laying in your house catching dust doing nothing you can make it work in your house you can make a stereo system instead of having them catching dust you know you can use them have fun with them for entertainment okay and that will be end of that procedure now everything's hooked up together now I'm gonna turn the radio over And I'm gonna connect the computer power cable. I'm gonna connect it to a power outlet. I'll be leaving the link in the video description if you wanna buy this uh, computer power supply and this power cable. I'm gonna leave the link in the video description. Now you're gonna connect the computer power cable to the computer power supply. Make sure this is soft before connecting it. Now it's connected. And now let's turn on the radio by switching on the computer power supply. Now the radio come up. Now I'm gonna connect my phone to this radio so you can hear the sound let me turn on my Bluetooth so I can connect to it now let me 
me commit. And then I'll be playing a song. Okay, now it's connected. Now let me put a song. Okay. Let me play this song. So you can see now we have in sound. Now let me let me turn up the volume. Well, there you have it, a fully functional car radio. Well, folks, this is it for the video. If you found this video helpful, consider subscribing, turning on the notification bell so you can be notified of my upcoming videos. Don't forget to share this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Like always, stay safe. Take care, God bless you all, and peace. Peter Pan, that's what they call me. I promise that you'll never be lonely.